downtown upper 50s, 57 right now out at the airport where winds are sustained from the southwest at 8 miles per hour. Temperatures across town, Boulder, you're at 55 right now, upper 50s into Castle Rock and Parker. You'll definitely want to wear a t-shirt later on this afternoon. Our highs are going to be warmer than yesterday, sunscreen for sure. Maybe want some sunglasses for the first half of the day before clouds increase this afternoon. 10 o'clock will be at 71 here across the metro area. High temperatures will top out in the upper 70s to low 80s. Clouds increase and our best chance for seeing storms mainly between about 2 and 7 o'clock tonight. Greeley, a high of 82 degrees this afternoon. Fort Collins in the upper 70s. Same into Boulder. This activity, once again, kind of like yesterday, will be very scattered and isolated in nature. 3 o'clock will be at 80 in Denver. Upper 70s to low 80s from Sterling out through Burlington down into Pueblo. If you're doing any um, traveling to and from the high country, should be nice and dry and mild for the first half of the day before things kind of pick up this afternoon. Our risk of severe weather mainly encompasses the Denver metro area up north into Fort Collins and across northeastern Colorado. Area shaded here in the darker green still indicate a low risk but could be seeing some cells with pockets of moderate to heavy rainfall very gusty could be damaging winds tornadic activity is not really expected across the plains but we could be definitely seeing some very strong storms especially over far northeastern Colorado but by 12 o'clock this afternoon up and down the I-25 corridor if you're outside for the first half of the day you'll be fine across the eastern plains nice and dry then we'll start to see those storms move into the foothills and mountains shower activity will intensify by about three o'clock out west It'll move across the plains, including the Denver metro area, by about 5. So it's one of those days maybe you bring the rain jacket, the umbrella along, or find just sort of a plan B, maybe under a tent somewhere. And then that activity will move east by about 7 o'clock. So through dinner time, we'll be under a partly cloudy sky. That storm activity will intensify across the far eastern plains. And then early tomorrow morning, once again, we'll wake up to more sunshine, dry conditions, and another round for late day storms. But our highs for tomorrow will be a little bit cooler. Mid-70s expected out at the airport, low 70s through Aurora Parker up into Fort Collins, 50s and 60s out west and taking us through our outlook for the next seven days. By Tuesday, low 70s with the chance for some isolated storm activity, then it's going to dry out a lot more as we go throughout the middle and end of the week. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, warming back to the low 80s with overnight lows in the low to mid 50s. And we'll keep you posted on just the severity of the weather as we go throughout the day today.